This is the energy vibration reading for all the Libra and Sun, Moon, and Rising. This is the month of November 2017, and I want to say welcome. Um, this is a month of the hurt energies. Thank you for the support, the likes, and the shares. And I want to say to each and every person out there, whatever you ask the universe for in this month is going to be wonderful. It is a month of yes, it's a month of good positive energies. You have a double whammy, which is temperance twice in the last week. So <clears throat> this month has five weeks. Let's see what the liberals, what more energies the liberals have. What other energies the liberals have in this month? Okay. All right. I am first going to look at the numbers that you can focus on in this month. So, as we look at your month, there is luck coming in. If there is a le legal suit, legal situation, there is luck coming in. There is going to be a lot of talk, um, conversations going on. Um, these are going to be um, soul connection from lifetime and lifetime before. So let's look and see what is your number. You have twice 14, so 14 is going to be one of your energy vibration numbers. You have also the number 9 energy, 6, that is a 7, twice 7, so you have to twice 7 and twice um, 14. So this, whatever is happening in <clears throat> your month it's going to be the number seven and the number 14 okay let's go forward and see what we have in the first week we have the energy vibration of destiny and destiny destiny come up as it can be um your luck it can for some people but yet still it can be a time when you need to connect with yourself where you have the energy of the hermit the energy of the hermit comes out in your world and this is saying to go within look for the answers because the answers lie within there is going to be a lot of conversation with you and people it can be spiritual people but it can also be um, people that have inner wisdom to give you so there's a lot of people who are going to be connecting with you and who are going to be helping you on your journey further. And they are people who are coming from past lives and past lives before. The number yellow, the energy of yellow in the first week is going to be the color of energy because I haven't even been using the colors um, the last time, but the color of the yellow energies is going to be very positive for a lot of you in this week. So whatever is happening, the energy of yellow is always uh, an healing, and it's always that Archangel Uriel is here asking and uh, stretching out his hand to show you that help is coming in. As we look forward, we have the energy of the hair sign which is your energy vibration in the second week second week is going to be a wonderful week for you you're going to be bringing in a lot of balances in your life but yet still you're going to be protecting yourself luck is coming in for a lot of you liberals in the second week so whatever situation that was happening in your life you need to understand that the energy of bringing balance in your life so whatever situation that was out of balance you are going to be bringing balance back in your life and with that balance you're going to be protecting yourself luck is going to come to you okay so this is a very good sign this is a very good week um, for you guys and in this week you are going to be working with 7 and 2 9 and 2 11 so you have uh, the total of uh, 11 so a portal is going to be opening up some of you can be connecting with your spirit guides and angels so this is going to be very good in the third week because we have five weeks we have the energy of a sacrifice and when the energy of sacrifice comes up that means you're sacrificing something you're giving up something you're leaving something behind so that something better can come in your life and you have the daughter of Pentacles the daughter of Pentacles is a wonderful energy because uh, um, 
the people between the ages of 18 20 25 30 35 uh, is going to be profiting and you are going to be the star the energy of the star that is coming in is a wonderful positive energy for a lot of people so whatever situation whatever you're dealing with there's a lot of promotions um, there's a lot of people who are going to be hearing that um, they're getting receiving um, promotions in their life so if you're between the ages of 18 and 35 there's a lot of promotions a lot of um, <clears throat> good news about your studies and that sort of a thing so it is really a positive energy because you are giving up um, you're sacrificing having fun and you know um, doing something to bring balance in your life and this is going to be good as we look forward we have the, the energy vibration of debt and transformation so there's a transformation whoever has lost something and there's arguments and quarrel uh, or break um, you are going to be asking for healing in this week there's going to be a lot of conflicts there's going to be a loss a lot of art breaks is going to happen in the fourth week and you just have to deal with it sometimes there is ending and you have to accept the endings that is coming in the number 11 is playing a significant role in the lives of you liberals in this month because second week you have 11 and the third week you have 11 coming back up so there is a portal there's an energy vibration of something that is healing and newness that is coming in heartbreak some people have the heartbreaks and quarrels a lot of heartbreaks and quarrels because you Gemini's needs you liberals needs to bring balance in your world and there's going to be a lot of heartbreaks and quarrel a lot of loss that is coming in we have um, 14 and 3 is 17 and 2 is 19 and 1 and 9 is 10 so it's the week the fourth week is going to be a new beginnings for a lot of people because of the endings that are coming in in the fourth week we have a doubly whammy so in the fourth week it's going to be positive um, a lot of people are going to be have to find balance with relationships if you're in a marriage you really 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 have to find a balance you have to find a way to balance and heal whatever imbalance that is going on in your relationships because a lot of people will be doing this a lot of people will be um, dealing with contracts and these contracts is going to be um, significant in your life because they can be business contracts or if you could be asked and this is not going to be acts the acts of marriage this is business contracts but um, what is going to affect some people are going to have business contract but some people are going to be affected with changes because for one and four is five so a lot of changes with um, marriages okay not endings um, some can move to that um, position of having endings but people who are in long-lasting relationship and who are married marriage in marriage they need to have balance you need to find balance in this so as I look at your month your month is actually crowned door three and uh, the number three is always significant because it's um, powerful the the energies of the number three is always powerful whatever the situation is the energies of the number three is always uh, um, a very very powerful so whatever is happening you can um, realize how significant certain things uh, is going to be happening in your life so listen to what you or feel and listen to your feelings there's a lot of people that is going to have a problem or situation with your kids it's not going to be bad some people are going to be really connecting with um, good things in their lives okay so whenever the energy of the number um, 12 energy comes up is always conversation verbal communication um, a lot of people will be having telephone calls a lot of people will be negotiating a lot of people would be having situations with um, um, your siblings some people are going to be coupled up or that sort of a thing and then we have um, a wonderful energy of productive conversation lucky telephone calls that sort of a thing that is going to be happening 
for you guys so you know this is not such a bad week because actually a bad month because actually there are good positive things that will be coming in and you know having good conversation there's going to be luck um taking a gamble um and and having a positive outcomes which is going to be very good for some people some people will be really taking a gamble but yet still having positive um good luck streaks uh, a lot of people will be having a lot of good luck and positive synchronicity and also a lot of success that will be happening the three first week is going to be extremely positive the fourth week is a week of um, certain aspects certain things that you need to clear up that is going to affect you and these are with relationships so especially for the people who are marriage engaged or that sort of a thing there is going to be transformation there's going to be lost in um, certain um, relationships and heartbreak for certain people in the four weeks so be aware of this okay um, whenever these energies come in I'm always saying to people you know um, it, it, it can also uh, for some people that it is success when you lose something you receive something else and that is wonderful success coming in so this can also be very positive for some people not all the time but certain energies affect uh, um, everyone sometimes it affects uh, people in positive way if you have positive thoughts as we look at the situation arguments are going to be coming up arguments discussion separations argument discussions and separations in some relationship relationship trouble okay um, I, yeah I've, I've seen this with a lot uh, of you Librans um, that is happening because this month is a month of uh, earth energy which is bringing balance so whatever situation if you have a child there is going to be conflicts of who um, who's having the child who's the child is going to be connecting with and that sort of an energy so um, be aware of that also so um, you have very very good positive energies that are coming out and um, what is also happening for a lot of you is that um, whatever the situation that occurs or whatever situation that open up um, good things are about to um, come out there is a secret that is going to come out um, people who have been having secrets and all in secrets a secret is going to come out and this could affect a child I'm getting a child I'm not getting a new beginning because obviously um, um, some of you are connected with children that are in relationship and certain secrets are going to come out maybe the child is going to tell another partner secrets so that is going to be happening let's um, see what is happening in the side of the zodiac is there anything any other messages um, there's a lot of um, past connection that is happening with people and relationship problems uh, the two last week which is uh, the fourth and fifth week there's going to be a lot of quarrels a lot of loss heartbreaks uh, and, and with people who are in long-term relationship for the same people you're going to have luck and the Sagittarius are going to come in to help you for the um, uh, yeah yeah that is going to be a lot of luck in love for some of you for the moon people the Capricorns are coming in and they're going to help you to change your career and work with you um, Saturnus that means it's going to be a huge change that is going to come up in your life for you Liberals, okay let's look at the Sun people what is happening for the Sun people for the people who were born um, 6 a.m. until 6 p.m. you have Jupiter Sagittarius and you have Venus Jupiter Sagittarius and Venus so what is happening here is that you're going to have a lot of luck but you're going to have luck um, with the 
um, Sagittarians people and you are going to have luck in love so whatever the situation is whatever that is playing around you you are going to have luck with Sagittarians people and a lot of luck in love go for it whatever is happening go for it you don't need to think about someone else because that is where your luck lies with that person so for instance if you were having or liking someone else and you think they are going to feel bad because you have move on um, they're not you know they're they're um, I guess they are not um, waiting on you or they are not uh, expecting that you should wait on them or whatever the situation I think they will be happy that you move on okay as we look at the people who were born between 6 p.m. and 6 and 12 6 p.m. and 12 a.m. we have the energies of the Capricorns coming in to help you and Mars so it's going to be a huge career change and it's going to be huge change there's going to be extremely extremely huge changes that is happening so whatever the situation is and whatever is happening there are going to be huge changes happening in your life whenever it comes on to your career and bring in balance back in your life so you are going to be working with um, Saturn the Capricorns are going to help you to bring balance in your life especially with your career so let's look forward and let's go forward to see whatever is going to be taking place in your life at this moment um, and what I have for you is the thought I think determine my relationship the relationship I attract so remember we need to think positive thoughts because if you think that you're always going to have um, arguments then you will have arguments in your relationship so um, it is saying um, not only does the power of your thoughts determine which people make their way into your life but it determines how they behave once they are there you're the thinker vibrational actions of your experience and the thoughts you think determine everything about the life you can live as you turn your attention towards the positive aspect of personalities and behaviors of others with whom you share your planet you will retain your point of attraction in the direction of only what you desire so let's say I or you decide to change your thought pattern let's say I've been always having negative people around me because I tend to be attracting them or clearing their energies now you're going to turn the thoughts and you're going to say to the universe I'm always attracting these low energies people and I'm asking to send me more positive uplifting people and you're going to just start to think about you having positive uplifting people in your life and they are going to come out um, in reality for you so I want to say to you liberants whatever the situation is with relationships and whatever the conflicts is move on because there for some of you um, the Sun sign are going to be working with Jupiter the lucky planet which is going to bring luck, luck in love because we have the energy of Jupiter and luck in love and this luck is going to have to deal with a Sagittarian so if you were born in the day you're going to realize that your luck lies by the Sagittarians if you were born in the night you're going to have to deal with huge career changes and huge changes coming up in your life I want to say to each and every person out there thank you for supporting my channel thank you for being here um, if you like a personalized reason because these are just general readings please um, connect um, I'm about to, to also do the 2018 um, readings they are on special now and um, I want to say to you it doesn't really matter what is going on in your life think positive acts for um, help from the universal angels and they will be doing that I want to say I love you and sending you positive love and light namaste